What's up, everybody? Today we have a cash out recommendation from Thomas. Thomas, you brought us back Thomas. into Nine Inch Nails once again. Nine Inch Nails, Gary Newman, cars. Go. You know what? Like, I want it to be there. <laughs> um, definitely. I'm so happy. I'm so um, glad. Damn. Oh, you know what? I was going to say my my first thought after the very end and going through the whole ride and how they did it uh, was I think this has to be the greatest performance of this song. To me, it does. <laughs> you have the original, but I don't know if there's a performance of Gary Newman doing the original that is going to be. I mean, to be fair, we haven't on this level of, listened to any anything. Live. Yeah, I mean live performances. No. But this um, interpretation and take on it. I agree. But yeah. Because if you know the song, you love the song already. This is like it's a iconic, nostalgic, like nostalgic, iconic eighties yeah. like I mean, come on. song the that you, ever. you better know. Yeah. <laughs> like I'm not gonna say you have to know, if you, you if better you play know. Music, you're gonna know. If you're if you're yeah. in the music world, you'll know this song. And 
And so like in the previous um, song that we just heard, where I felt it was such a good hybrid of them both. Oh, metal? Metal. Yeah, that, that's what um, it was called. This title. song. Yeah. Outstanding. It was like, okay, you take an iconic song um, and you bring Nine Inch Nails into it and it's, it works. It, it was really it, incredible. It was so well done. good. And their energy seems to like, it, it's like synergy between them. Well, you know, yeah, it, like I saw Gary uh, Newman smiling and I was like, oh, they're having a blast. And it's they're great to see. They're having a blast. Yeah. And it comes across because I had a blast. That's and why their performance was delivered so well because they were enjoying themselves. It, it came across such naturally. A good performance. Yeah. It made me so happy. Yeah, that's why I say, you know, to be a fly on the wall because you can only just wish to be one of these bands and, you know, watching live these performances and one of these live performances mm -hmm. and just, ugh. Well, they gave uh, us the opportunity to kind of be on stage with them in a way, yeah. you know, through this kind of format, you know, that's yeah. what they wanted to do, to do, give you the people that weren't there an intimate experience to see the band. So they were like, hey, we'll just film it on stage. Like the audience that's going to view this later is going to feel like they're going to be on stage with us while we perform the song. So yeah. I think that was very well impactful too in watching something like this and perform the song. So yeah. Um, so good, but um, before you wrap that up, you gotta talk about mm -hmm. you gotta talk about Trent with uh, oh, what, the what's the official name? Tambourine. tambourine. That was iconic, <laughs> classic. I will, you know, so him sitting there because I I heard it and then it panned to him and then I'm like, well, it's on the song too. It's on the track, right? And there he is, he was tambourine. It. He nailed it, man. Tambourine, you gotta it. get that rhythm. He so he it. did, and he was playing keyboards with one hand while he was doing the other. Yeah, so like, it was. It was Dude. impressive. It was great that he was doing out <laughs> out of anybody else. But that said, I have to say it where where it made me giggle. It took me back to that um, Will Ferrell skit of like more oh, cowbell, cowbell, more cowbell. It's a great take. Yeah, definitely. Right. <laughs> yeah. It was perfect. <laughs> I loved it. Okay. Yeah. So. <laughs> um, next Nine Inch Nails song. Uh, if you guys want to be there the next time we do check out the next Nine Inch Nails song, go ahead and subscribe so you'll be there along with us for the ride. Um, let us know in the comments below where we should go with the next one. They always do.